What's good, YouTube? Back again with another video for you guys. In today's video, we're going to show you a Patrick Peterson Nike Elite jersey. So I'm rocking one. I'm going to show you the other. They're essentially the same exact jersey, obviously, except for colorway. So let's get right on to it. Now, Fanatics had these not too long ago on sale for $111 when I bought both of these. They even went lower in price to 70 bucks. And that's when my boy Snacks snatched up the red one. Patrick Peterson is one of the greatest cornerbacks of all time. Definitely up there in the top, top tier of cornerbacks. And now he's going to Minnesota. So, of course, all his Cardinals jerseys will be on sale. All right. So, definitely a dope jersey. As you can see, this is how a size 52 fits on me. So, definitely nice how it fits. Of course, this is the first generation elite jersey. You have the longer sleeves, you have the paneling across the chest and the mesh and all this other stuff. So we're going to get into that with this jersey right here. All right. The first thing I'm going to show you guys is numbers, man. So as you can see here, the numbers are done really, really nicely. And the cardinals across the chest, no cross stitching. I'm going to do a what's real, what's fake video and cross stitching across this chest is usually a good indication that you may have something a little funny. As we get into the paneling, so Nike kept the stretch woven material, but what they did on this first generation is they only put it in certain spots. So as you can see here, the stretch woven materials across the top, but the mesh is like a regular football jersey mesh on the bottom. So this is kind of like a hybrid between a mesh jersey and a stretch woven jersey. Now they've completely gone to the stretch woven. They don't even use the mesh anymore. So you'll see the stretch woven material throughout the jersey. And on the sides of the jersey, you'll have the mesh. You'll have nice thick lining on these jerseys. That's another thing you could tell from a fake. Usually fakes have really thin lines especially when they have designs like this one. You have the pearlized Nike NFL Shield logo. You have the fly wire on the neck collar. That's supposed to be for reinforcement. They now move to the chain mail for the reinforcement in case you pull on the collar. Of course, this is an on-field feature, but if you pull on the collar, it's reinforcement to bring the collar right back. Definitely dope. You have your Nike patch on the shoulder. You have your 21 kiss cut on the shoulder pad as well and uh let's take a look at the jock tag man so you have the jock tag right here and that satin finish nice heavy duty jock tag one of my favorite jock tags and this has like a real silky feel to it so it's not going to feel um like a cotton or like anything else you've really seen i love this jock tag and even on the nfl logo you actually have dimensional touch to it so the nfl is a little bit raised the stars are a little bit raised. The NFL players logo is a little bit raised. So definitely dope. The Nike symbol is a little bit raised. So definitely dope what they did with this jock tag. My favorite jock tag is definitely this one right here. And that's pretty much it, man. So when you're looking on eBay, what you want to make sure is that this stretch woven is actually a stretch. So I'll show you guys. You see how that, that, that stretches. You want to make sure that that stretches. And also, if you want to sprinkle a little bit of water on it, uh, it should repel water. All right. That's definitely going to tell you whether or not you have a, a fake or a real. This gray lining in the inside of the neck tag, you're going to see that as well on the first generation elite jerseys. And then it also goes down to the, the hem on the elite jerseys. Also on the elite jerseys, you have a hem. So on the new elite jerseys, you don't have a hem. So that is something to um, consider when you're trying to get these on eBay, for sure. And just a little bit more detail on the bird you have there, all right? The Peterson's done in the kiss cut. So definitely a dope jersey. Take a look at the tags. You know, the tags are always fake, so it is what it is. But yeah, this is a Fanatics run. Take a look at the neck tag for you guys. And that's the neck tag. And on this tag, you should have your 52. Let me see. There we go. You should have your 52. You're made in Honduras. So that is that, man. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Patrick Peterson jersey. Dope jersey for sure. Definitely glad to have it in the collection. Great cornerback. And that's that. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. We out. Peace.